my agent tells me that I need to be on TV. He said, hey, golly, I can put you on Dancing with the Stars. Doing what, you guys? I can't dance and I'm not a star. <laughs> and that makes me perfect for that show. <laughs> he said, hey, I can put you on The Bachelor. <laughs> Big deal, I've been on a few Bachelors. <laughs> I don't need an agent for that, thank you. <laughs> He said, well, as long as you do comedy, don't do any racist jokes because, you know, it can damage your career. I told him, don't worry, I don't have any career. Um, <laughs> I do have friends, uh, my best friends, seriously. They're a married couple. The wife is from India and her husband is from Pakistan. I told them, wow, you guys are a match made in heaven. Indian and Pakistan, that's like half 7-Eleven, half 9-Eleven. <laughs> Okay, I lost 50% of you. <laughs> Thank yeah. you. The other 80% are still with me. <laughs> Love you guys. Good. Racist over there. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know those people who sneeze in your face and say, ah, it's just allergy? I punch them in the face and say, ah, it's just anger. <laughs> One night I was getting dressed to go out with someone. Then he called me last minute and he said, oh, I don't want to take you to this club because over there men are just going to try and get into your pants. I said, okay, I'll wear a skirt. <laughs> we were dating for a while, but we were not a good match. He was a Gemini and I was married. Um, <laughs> Then I went on a date with someone who told me, oh, you're a comedian? Uh-uh, you guys are all bipolar. I said, that's not true. We are sad, LOL. <laughs> I was dating a guy who called me a cougar. Yeah, so rude, those teenagers. Oh my God. No respect. I don't know if you guys heard, but uh, Colorado passed two laws recently, maybe a year ago. Uh, gay marriage and legalized marijuana on the same day. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah, I know, you guys, and it makes sense. Even the Bible says if a man lies with another man, they should be stoned. <laughs> I love you guys. Thank you so much.